Okay. Very quickly. Yes, you may. All right, share my screen. Here we go. All right. Are we ready, Mr. Max? Two stars, are we ready? All right. Oh, that is not what I wanted. There's what I wanted. It's not that one, though. Uh-oh. All right. Let me just put in presentation mode, and I need to hear everybody. So I don't know why it's not letting me do present mode. Present mode. Okay, so I hear other sounds than the sound I need. Some of us are awfully silly these days and are not yet. This isn't silly, guys. We're learning how to do these. Yeah. All right, so I want ah. Ah. Uh. Duh. Ah. Uh. Oh, that one confused us. This is this week's, what, is, what should it sound like? <sighs> right? It should sound like what sound? An F sound, yes. Because it, it's not puh, puh. It's not a blend. It's puh. Okay. Uh. Everybody should be saying it. Everybody. Uh. 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 Uh, oh, I like how uh, good job um, doing the symbol. Uh. Mm. And then what? Mm. What? Ra. Ra. Yeah. Everybody. Spa. Now here's my blend. Spa. Shra. What? La. La. Spa. So take a look at this one real quick. So you'll notice that Mrs. Harrison, when she does a blend at the beginning of a word, she always uses S C because very rarely is it S. Hey, and some of us really had trouble with that last week, so I'm just going to focus on that for just a moment. Oh, 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 dress, 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 That is the ending sound, right? Okay, we're not drawing. Our pencils are down. Thank you. Oops. Good. Next. What's a good word for this? Next. Good. Good. Oop. What's another word for this one? Help or gulp or mm, L has to be at the end. Oop. Elk. 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 Good one, Astria. Oop. <laughs> L. Say, so say the sound first, and then if I ask what the word is, then you can give me the word. Okay. Here we go. Good. Ong. 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 All right. Oh, gotta go. Nobody can. Hmm. Hey, my friend. Yeah. You need to have that on for me because you don't need it. Thank you. All right. Here we go. What? What? Oh, whisk, whisk, gra, gra, oh, gra. I don't know what happened there. That one was weird. Things are not happening the way I want them. Gra, eh, gra, 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 Unk. Unk. Chunk. La. 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 Uh. Lunch. Okay, I really need us to do this together, my friends. I know we're scattered around the room, but I'm looking for everybody. Here we go. La. E. Bliss. La. La. E. Mm. Swim. Sl. A. Sl. 
a slush. Slush. Pull. Plank. 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 Oh. oh. So. Very good. All right. That is because it's have our long O sound. No, that is how you spell O. No, we're using our so tell you, don't our, but that's using our rules. We have those parts. All right. <clears throat> but we know it's our magic E, right? Yeah. So then it needs to say the way our rules are. Because it's actually so much quicker if I just click on it than if me if me putting the, the thing back. They are real all well, real words at the moment. All right, you're right. It's true. You will, do you like it when they're not real words? Gotcha. All right. I'll start shoving some more of those into the um into the rapid word thing, maybe. All right. So my friends um at at home, if you can get out your sand tray um and have that nearby, I'm gonna get these out real quick. All right. So, please, if you have or did not have them out in front of the time today. Yeah, why did I do that? Because we met last time. You couldn't handle it. All right. Mr. Matt, Mr. Charlie, I'm not sure if you have something you can work with at home. Or a soda, please. Where is Charlie? Why do you always have a car? Because he's around the room. see my doc camera sorry friends all right here we go all right we're gonna split our sand tray are you all right i'm gonna start with this one Zzz. Very good. Two Z's, right? Very nice. All right. Next one, we're going to split three sections. There we go. Are you ready? Yo, Lennox knows, doesn't he? All right. It's going to be F, F says F, F says P, H says very nice. We got three in there, don't we? All right. Next one. <clears throat> Here we go. This one is going to be another split. I probably can't trick you, though. It's t t Oh, I didn't trick you. Very nice. T says t. E D says t. At the end of words like asked. It makes a T sound. Here we go. All right. Ch. Ch. C H says ch. All right. Ah. Very nice. All right. Um, split the sand. Ch. Ch. C says ch. C. Oh, sorry. I'm ready to do my third one. Next week, we'll have three. K says, K. we're going to do that next week. CK comes next week. All right. Finally getting to CK, my friend Bird. Yep. All right. Then you'll, you'll have all kinds of things you can add to it. All right. Next, uh, we'll split the screen. All right. Split the sand. 
All right, ready? Duh, duh. Very good. Make sure, is your D facing the right direction? Mr. August, is your D facing the right direction? All right, is it a, did you write a capital D or a lowercase D? All right, good job. All right, here we go. Ah, ah. You says, ah, very good. All right. <clears throat> um, all right. Eh, eh. Very nice. Yeah, for itchy, yep. Yeah, for itchy. All right. <clears throat> All right, split your sand. All right. Very nice. All right. Uh, bah, bah. Okay, make sure your B is facing the right direction. Did everybody look? There were, we had a couple Bs last week that were reversed on test. Make sure you have your bat and your ball, right? Or use your bad idea of being the right direction. All right. Split your sand. Wah, wah. Wah, very good. Wah. W says what? W H. Very nice. All right, we're almost done. Okay, we've got some endings. All right, some endings. So we'll have a little like hyphen kind of look thing there. Hyphen. Are you ready? T T says. I know it's hard for me to do it under the mask. All right, next one. Charlie, how's it going? You paying attention? Are you thinking? Am I, are we doing good? Oh, I love how you're using that. That's a great idea, buddy. That's much probably easier than sand in the car, huh? Good idea. Very good idea. All right. Um, <clears throat> oh, ah. All right. Are you ready? Split your sand. You. Ah, uh, oh, we, oh, we lost our um. You says you, you consonant e magic e says you. Oh, I have. All right, split your screen again. Here we go. Are you ready? I says I. I consonant magic E says I. Very good. Yeah, you forgot to write that, Sawyer. All right. Nice job. Let's do this one one more time. It's a yes, we did it already, but I'm going to do it again. Split your screen because it has to do with what today is about, which is F says P H. Says. All right, we're gonna focus on pH. Uh, oh, sorry. Yes, you. I need an FF. Good. Good. Sorry. All right, three. Here we go. All right. F says. F F says pH. I know. I did it on purpose twice, didn't I? Well, today we're going to make sure we understand that before tomorrow's spelling test. <coughs> All right. Do you need to go ahead and put it back in the bag for me, please? Put it back in the bag. Miss Astria, you obviously you just can put it to the side. Everybody else, put it back in the bag for me, gently. August, back in the bag. All right. There we go. Okay. Go to side for me. All right. So what we talked about last week or earlier in the week is we had all of the words that we talked about words that have an F sound in them and how we are going to spell them. So let's 
see if we can form three categories. All right. We're going to do just plain old F. We're going to do SS. And our last category, PH. All right. So no cloud today because we're going to put them in one, two, or the third category. All right. I'm just going to randomly pick. And you, so everybody have an F word. Yep. Think about or FF word or a PH word. Everybody think of one. At least what something that makes up sound. All right, Sunny. Fluffy. Say it again. Fluffy. Fluffy. Oh, that goes in two categories, doesn't it? Hmm. You're that was tricky of you. Which two categories should it go under? Yeah. So I will write it in both categories. That was tricky. That was tricky, Sunny. All right, Gabe. Fish, which category should that go in? Yep. All right. Miss Astria, give me an, a word with an F sound. You want to give me an example of one, my friend, Miss Astria? Something to go in one of those categories? Can you think of an F word? I'll come back to you if you need a little extra time. All right. Uh, Max. C, or F, F, sorry. Fly. Fly. Which category does that go into? F. F. Very good. She might be. That's okay, Charlie. Puff. Puff. Which category is that one in? Very good. Puff. A puff of smoke. Bird. Phone. Phone. Which category does that go in? Very good. Excellent. Sawyer. Finn's name. Finn's name. Which category does that go in? Uh, 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 okay, so Finn let him do his own. Sorry. He got to do his. Abby? Not mine. Okay, then think of another one. Uh, Maxie? Fun. Say it again? Fun. Fun. Which category does that go in? Uh, uh, all right. Let's see if we can get some more in here and here. Cerne, any ideas? No? All right. It doesn't have to be at the beginning. It can be in the middle or the end. Think of a butter. Food? Like something you eat? Which category does that go in? F. And then what was your second one? Foam? Like fuzzy, bubbly stuff? Foam? Okay. Which category does that go in? Hmm. So it does, it, it's actually, if we have foam, it's going to be this one. That's the pH is a tricky one for sure. Certainly. Funny. Funny. Which category is that one going? Funny. Yep. Very nice. All right, Gabe. Information. Good job. The F in the middle. And it is information. Astria, you thought of one? Heather. Feather, which category does that go in? F. Uh, F, yes. Feather. Three. All right. I'm looking for, can we try to add some more to this one and yeah. this one? Yeah. So we have a little bit more. Mr. Josh, Mr. Josh, you get your hand up or you just got them. Okay. Them too. So here. Elephant. Yeah. Elephant, which category? Uh, PH. PH. That was your one from the other day, wasn't it? Elephant. Bird. And four. All right. Let's pick one. Which one? Fit. Fit. Okay. So which category, Miss Fit? S. S. Capital, though, right? All right. Uh, Finn. Um, life. Life. Okay. Life. So that's our F in the inside. Yep, for sure. We're right. I ran out of room, so we have to keep. We got to focus on the FF and PH. Mr. Van Rickley, do you have a word that you want to add to our list? All right. Mr. Charlie, if you decide it. Yep. Mr. Charlie? Giraffe. Say it one more time. Giraffe. Raft? Like rat or rat? With a P on the end or a T on the end? Raft. 
G A Raph? G A A P H. Ah, okay. Good graph. Got it. Excellent. All right. Uh, Max Caesar. Dolphin. Oh, I I forgot to, I, to ask which part, which lane you're in, there, right? Oops, sorry. Uh, Sunny. Amphibian. Amphibian. Good. You guys are remembering Monday. You're remembering Monday now. This is good. For a minute, I thought you forgot about Monday. Max Fox. Say it again. Flip phone. Flip phone. Well, I'm gonna uh, I'm gonna have to put that in one this one here, I guess, yeah. because. And that's technically probably two words, really, but I'm going to all take it. Uh, good. Say again? Flying. Okay, so that'll be an F word. That would work to fly. Fly, we had E to it, right? Awesome. Okay, I'm out of room on that side, so we got to focus on these two here. Surname? Puffy? Well, yep, that would just be this one with a one on the end. A Y, yep. I mean, we could just add it to that. Very good. Sorry. Um, Headphone. Okay. Headphone. Yes, Astria. Telephone. Telephone. Very good. Anybody? Oh, yeah. Photo. Good one. And then we have photo, photograph. We do. We need some more of those. August. Smartphone, yep. So that's good. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, yeah, we got lots of phones here, don't we? That's definitely uh, a theme going on there. Max? Different. Oh, that is F, F. Um, I'll go ahead and put it under here, although technically, because uh, it does have F, F, so that was good, but it's F, F because it's two syllables. So different. So there's, it's, Separate sounds because it has instead of one F sound, it's actually two. So you give us a different. See how it sounds F like twice? But I'll take it because I'm guessing. All right. Love it. Say it again. Can you use it in a sentence for me? Oh, it's a name. Ah, okay. I'm not sure how to spell that one. Do you know how to spell this one? Puffy. No. Uh, yeah. Very nice. Okay. Well, it does have the X sound for sure. I'm. I'm. I, I. We'll have to research that one. We'll definitely have to research Wait, that. One. All right. So we're gonna stop here because we also have to do some. Um, sorry. So coffee is actually again. Coffee's like different. It's coffee. Two F sounds. But I was I was getting desperate. You're right. All right. So I'm gonna stop there. I want you to go ahead and take out. Um, make sure you have your pencil ready. We are gonna do uh we have our syllable division. We gotta get done. You guys did great on the So what so what we learned there is what spells at with the F sound most often? Yeah, right? last time since they were only one side all right here we go ready for the first word we're gonna write it down for me one of my favorite words here we go write down that word for me write down the word for me 
right. So what are you supposed to be doing, August? You're supposed to be, nope, you're supposed to be writing this, these letters down. Oh, do you have a bed, a bed with pencil? Your bed is in the wrong spot, it looks like. Or if you really can't find one, you know, August, you know where they are, right? You have all the extras over here. You can have one over here. All right. Oh, it's just hiding. Oh, it's camouflage. All right, Sernay, where do I start? Very good. There's my two vowels. And I bridge my vowel. Very good. Then what do I have to do, Sernay? I only have one consonant, don't I? All right, well, that's great. So now what do I have to do? I have to decide where to split it, right? Do I have, how many options do I have? Two options, don't I? So if you have your, if you have your green folder, you should have your, your syllable splitter inside your, um, inside your little zip box. If you lost it, that's okay. You can just use your pencil. So it could go here, or it could go here, or it could go where is where's it gonna go? We're gonna go here, or are we gonna go here? What do we think? Where do we want to do it? Why do you think between the O and the C? All right, so Miss, a so my friends at home, Cerne just said that she, because she knows how to pronounce this word, she knows that that's a long O sound, so that she knows, yeah, so she knows that she needs to divide it here. Now, if you didn't know what this word was, if you had, then you ha might have to try it both ways, right? You might have to see is it fo cut or is it fa? That's not a real very good. That's not youth. Youth. That's not. Does that even sound like a word? No, it doesn't at all. So, which kind of vowel is? Or not vowel. Which kind of syllable is this first part? Yes. This, what kind of syllable, Mr. Gabe, is the beginning? It's an open syllable. Very good. And let's write. Let's draw. Then it's long O over it. And then what kind of, what kind of syllable is the next one then? Close. And so that makes us, uh, makes our short, doesn't it? Makes our short sound. So when we read it, we say fo, ka, ka, fo, ka, focus, right? Focus. I, I say hocus pocus, everybody. Focus. So that was a word we see a lot, isn't it? Or hear a lot, even though we don't necessarily see it. All right, here's my next one. Hey, just write the letters, don't say the word. There we go. Writing down our letters, writing down our letters. Then I want you to go ahead and mark the vowels so you can figure out where to divide it. If you haven't heard this word before, that's okay. Then just sound it out both ways and see if it sounds like a word that sounds familiar. Mm, Miss Ashley's figuring it out. She's got a thinking, thinking face on. So when you're trying to figure it out, you sound it out both ways and see if it sounds. If you don't know what that word is, try to pick some words that are a little bit Unusual. Hmm. Oh, my friend Lennox has got things marked up. Well, we see. Mr. Fenn, show me what, what you what you decided. Did you decide? Oh no, I just want you to show it to me because I want everybody to see. Yeah. Okay. All right. Mr. Abby, can you show me what you decided? Yeah, can you hold it up and show me what you decided? Or did you not decide yet? You're not sure where to divide it? That's good. Okay, that's why we're doing this, right? It's totally okay. 
Mr. Charlie, got a plan? All right. Hi, Abby. All right. Here we go. Well, let's mark our vowels. We'll see how we decide what we decide here. Here's our yep, bridge and then our one C. So we know that we either have to divide it here or we have to divide it here. Hmm. How many people think, raise your hand if you think I've, I'm going to divide it here. Raise your hand if I think it goes there. Raise your hand if you think it goes here. All right, we got to oh, and we have a couple people who aren't sure. That's totally fine. All right, well, let's let's sound it out. If we put it here, then this has to be a long A, right? Late at latex, latex. Does that sound like a word we maybe have heard before? Maybe. Okay, let's try it out here though. Lat, lat, eat. Lat eat. Lat eat. Hmm. Which one do we think it is? First one or the second one? First one. And I bet if there were other words around it, that would also help to help you with the context of it. But it does go here. You are most of you were correct. It does go there. So this is our open syllable. This is our closed syllable. Very nice. Last word. Oh, long A sound. Short E sound. Here we go. Try and write those letters down. See if you can make a decision. See what you think. So every time we were, every once in a while, we run into those words that we're not sure about, right? Okay, while you're getting that written down and decision making, I'm going to quickly and <laughs> see my time. All right, we just upside down for now. No, that's not a bit. Are you okay? Oh, are we getting this letter? Yeah. All right. Oh, wait, here we go. All right. Where do you think those? Where are those vowels? The last one. What? The last one? That's the last one. That's the last one. All right. Let's see. So I have a line here. I'm seeing a lot of lot of. Lot of. Lot of. Lot of. A lot of use back there. All right, let's see. All right, there is my bell. There's my bell. Here's my bridge. There's my C. So we either have this choice or this choice, right? A lot of you pick this one. So let's sound it out. Lot use. Lot use. Lot use. That's not the word. Yeah. Yeah. Think so? Hmm. That, can you use it in a sentence? Do you think that's the right sentence? Lot use. That sound familiar? No. The other word may not sound familiar either, but let's try it out. Low us. Low us. Lotus. Does that sound like a word we may have heard before? Yeah. Yeah. It is. That is our word. Does anybody know what a what a lotus is? Yeah. No. So what do you think? What do you think? Spanish? It is a flower. Yes, there's a plant that has a flower. Lotus flower. Very nice. So here's our long open. Here's our close. Long O. Is a lotus? A lotus plant has a lotus flower. All right. All right, my friends, nice job. Keep that safe for me. Um, I will probably uh, collect those a little bit later. All right, take care to rapid word chart, Miss um, Miss Astria and Mr. Charlie. Can you see that? Okay, I'm gonna make it a little bit bigger. All right, I'm make it a little bigger, Charlie, so you can see it better. Is that better, Charlie? There we go for you. All right, everybody else has one on their desk. Turn it over. Look at the box. Turn it over. Turn the paper over. Okay. Oh. No, I 
No, the one I gave you. There it is. I know what is uh, not a real word. Oh, yes, probably. All right, on your marks. Are you ready for a minute? Yeah. Gotta find my phone because I don't. My, I put my timer over here every single day, and then it just disappears. All right, here we go. Here's my timer. On your mark, get set, go. Give me time. If you have any old ones, you can put those behind it. All right. Oh, my God. <laughs> All right. Here we go. Oh, so I have four, five. Ooh, Miss Astria. Nice job. 10 times all the way through. Reading it for hours. I was going to say that seems a little extreme even for me. Wow, Charlie, nice job. All right. So, any, did we have any words that we found? Uh oh. Ready to focus. Here we go. Did anybody find any uh, words that were this week's focus idea? Cerne, do you see any PH words? Graph. Graph. Very good. What else, Mr. Charlie Carr? Phone. Very good. Another one. Here's more. Good. Photo. Do we have any others? I think those are all. Oh, nope. I, got, I, I did sneak in another one. <laughs> Max Fox? Sphere. Oh, so say so that. Try to speak. Sphere. There's no puff in it because it's just an F sound. Sphere. Very good. Sphere. All right. Are there any non words in there? This verb? Yes. That, that is actually a word. Act is a word. Yeah. Oh, but D is a what? So that's not, we don't say D, we say what when we get to that? The, the. So that's our, that's our phoneme. You just, no, I'm just marking it up so this one's mine. You don't have to mark anything on yours. All right. Um, any other words you don't, aren't sure what they mean? Mr. Surname. With uh, Yule, ah, so um, around Christmas time, you might hear of a Yule log or the, did you just remember that? Yep, so that would go under there like a Yule log or oh, anybody else have any words that they think are not real? So act, I used the act to chop down the tree. Act, yeah. All right. No, not a. Why is so? It's not long a because it doesn't come. It's a. It's a. It's going to be our short because it's got our short vowel. And so that's so when you talk about the the company that has the um various um yeah, sentence things, that's a f t. You're right, and they do pronounce it act. You're right, but this kind of act, this is the one that we use. Our, um, but yes, Charlie. Yes, Charlie. Yes, Charlie. Woohoo! Dwell. Ah, oh, that's a good one. Is that where it's? Oh, there, right there. Dwell. So when you live someplace or you stay for a long time, you might dwell there. I dwell in the valley of the lotus plant. So that means to live. But so that's what that word means. If you see it again. All right. So anybody else? Oh, they are all real words today. Did we have we had a combination of all kinds of things that I put in there today. All right, can you put this one with your other ones? 
so so I have several of you who forgot to take out your new rat, your old rapid ones to put with your new one because really boy, Lennox had them all. Um, but usually if you just put them in a nice stack, you just read through them and see how many. And I know Astrid, you just have to read the one that's here, don't you? So that's okay though. Oh, no worries. You could always print it out if you really, really wanted to, but you know, I understand. All right. So we are hold that thought. So we are done with that for today. Um so I'm going to keep, um, so what I would like you friends to do, um, for I, I need to meet with my friends online um, for a minute, um, and I'm going to try to get another group in um, before the end of my time. The rest of you need to take out, take out your fluency papers, so either your camping paper or your moment in time poem. I want you to read it through twice, and then you can do amplify until I see you. I also need to see Charlie. And uh, Max Fox, too, because I am going to go over your, not quite yet. So go ahead and do those other things first. So read it two times. So, Max, if you're looking for your camping thing to read two times. All right, Miss Astria, just go ahead and um, chill out for a minute. You know, read your camp, um, read the camping thing. It's attached to the assignment today. And just chill out for a minute while I talk to Charlie. Okay? Can you do that for me? All right, you're great. All right, Mr. Charlie. I'm going to turn on. I'm going to stop sharing, first of all. I just went on a boat today. Did you? What? I went on a boat. And so massive alligators. 